Okay, so it's bonfire night in the UK, fireworks night. There's lots of fireworks in the sky and we celebrate this every year on the 5th of November. We have fires and sparklers. Tomorrow's lesson is about what to say when you score a goal. And I think there's lots of firework language with this. It's a rocket. What a screamer. So I'm going to set off a firework. <clears throat> and give you lots of vocabulary tomorrow about what to say when you score a goal. You can say it's a screamer, which is a type of firework. <laughs> See you in the classroom. Okay, so what to say when you score a goal. Well, it's different in different languages. I know in the UK, people say yes or yeah when a goal is scored. So it's a different crowd noise. In Spanish or in Portuguese, people say gol or gol. So this sound is like oh. Whereas in the UK, <clears throat> it is a yeah sound. <laughs> I always see Spanish or Portuguese footballers saying this Vamos or vamos Which in Spanish means let's go Even Gareth Bale did this last week when he scored a goal in England for Tottenham Hotspur He said vamos You thought you'd never see it again Gareth Bale scoring for Spurs So in English vamos means let's go and I know American people sometimes say this, they say, let's go, let's go Liverpool. But in the UK, we don't say let's go, never watching football. We never say, let's go Liverpool, never. We sometimes say, or we say, come on, come on Liverpool. So maybe when you score, you might shout, yes, come on. Or a very popular one is get in. <laughs> There you go. Oh, get in there! Wow! On the same now. On the other side there, Rube. What a strike! So many British people say, get in. Yes, get in! And you might say, get in there. Get in, you beauty. I know in Italian they say, bellissimo. I scored a goal once in Italy and somebody said, wow, bellissimo. But we don't say beautiful, we would say maybe get in, you beauty. Mella, lovely cushion header, Pajero! Oh, you beauty! Okay, so bonfire night yesterday and a type of firework is a screamer. The one that makes a loud noise is a screamer and we say this for a goal in English too if it's a really good goal a very hard shot it's a screamer or it's a rocket some more bonfire night language is he's on fire but this is American I think I always remember playing a basketball computer game and the ball was on fire if they were in form if they were doing well he's heating up More slang, British English, is on flames. So a flame is connected to a fire and we say he is on flames, which is the same meaning as he is on fire. More slang. So for the top corner, if you score in the top corner of the goal, we say the top corner, but slang is the top bin.
I knew I could do it. Get in there. That's what I'm about. Woo, Gaza! Or the top bracket, or the top banjo. And I hear this word a lot now, a worldie. So it's very similar to a screamer. If you score a really good goal, or maybe you dribble past two or three players and score an amazing goal, it is a worldie. You, or maybe you hit a worldie if you score from 30 meters out, 30 yards out, it is a worldie. <laughs> Do you have any vocabulary or any slang for the top corner of a goal in football? Please comment in the video. Okay, so pick this one out, V, or versus pick that one out. So what is the difference between pick this one out and pick that one out? So this is the difference between this and that. So this is close to you, that is far away from you. Also, it's related to time a little bit. I think this is about to happen, is going to happen. So you say, pick this one out when you have the ball and you're in front of the goalkeeper taking a shot. You say, pick this one out before you shoot. Pick that one out is after you shoot. So you're telling the goalkeeper to pick the ball out of the net. So pick this one out before you shoot. Pick that one out is after you shoot. Yes! Come on, Jim. Special. Go ahead, keep. Go on. Pick that one out. You scored, yeah? Go <laughs> oh, shot! Oh, wow! <laughs> Stop it! That's one of them! Also, in English, we say, what a goal. If it's a really good goal, I think in Spanish is que golazo or golazo. So what a strike, maybe, if it's a very clean shot, a strong shot. Or what a header, if it's a header. Or what a volley, if it's no bounce and it's a volley. We say, what a volley. I really like a person on YouTube called Jimmy Bullard. He was a professional football player in England. Now he is a TV personality and he visits different training grounds. And when he scores, he says, that's what I do. <laughs> Which I think is quite funny. So when he scores, he's like, that has just happened. That's what I do. I score goals. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I have a Facebook group if, if you want to join the Facebook group. See you in the next video.